Hey guys, it's Renee. Welcome to this Hack DIY. Today I'm going to show you how to easily remove or detangle knots from Shane necklaces. Before, I would just go ahead and try to do this movement, but this never undid the knot. It just changed its position or made it worse. So what you have to do is do the same thing to just loosen up the knot, but that's just not enough. Then place your necklace on a steady like surface. Then use two toothpicks and just try to see where the knot is at and then just open it like straight away, like that. There are different kinds of necklaces. This is one of them and then I have this one. And I'm going to make a knot in here so you can see. Let's just pretend that this is how it magically appeared. It always happens like that. Loosen up and then work with my toothpicks. Trying to find the knot itself and then just pull it. And then I have this one. It's pretty helpful, this one. Somehow the knot turns out to be double. So I have this and then on top I have another one. I have no idea how that happens, but double knots are even worse than that. But it's pretty much the same. I'm just going to loosen my knot, the first one, get rid of that, then go again and do the same thing. Just go ahead and find the knot and carefully, you don't want to damage your necklace. And just for practice, just because it just happens in real life, it's like they know, right? They kind of smell the fear or the stress level. They just decide to say, hey, Guess what? No, this is not the double knot that I want to go for. Okay, this is another option. Happens to me all the time as well. So there is one. I'm just working with this one. If the light changes throughout this whole video, it's because it's cloudy and it's sunny. And, and this is like the mother of all knots or the father. Like really, really in there. You can't even open your necklace. Has that ever happened to you? Am I alone here? It's gonna be actually easier because it's a whole thing. So you just have to loosen this thing like that. And I guess you can even use a hand if you're really like on the go and in a car for instance. You can use somebody's hand. Just keep in mind that you're gonna be using toothpicks. So yeah, I hope you found it helpful. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for more stuff. I have a ton of DIYs, hacks, baking as well. Don't forget to share it so more people can watch. Thank you so much for watching. I'll talk to you later and take care. Bye guys! Is my camera on? Yes, it is. I think they are female or male because they are nuts. Oh god, rumbling.